we're having <laughs> two going, but guys, this is not going to be a video you're going to want to miss out on watching live or over the weekend because we have at the end, we're going to give more details on our fun giveaway, yes. but stay tuned to the end to learn about it. But today we're going to dive into some really fun projects. Well, you know, it, it was kind of an accidental thing. Definitely okay, was. But it's actually perfect because Tanner and I met at a cricket event a year mm -hmm. ago where we were both ambassadors for the new maker and I'd never met him. We immediately clicked like Besties. best friends <laughs> and we've been wanting to do this for a long time. So yeah. I think it's actually perfect that it ended up all three of our all lives three. are about the cricket. All about the cricket. <laughs> and it was completely accidental. Like, yeah. seriously, they did not pay us to no, do this. No, no. <laughs> or uh, even ask us to no. do this. No, and it's just so even great. when we were brainstorming, we really wanted to have diversity. Right. We wanted to build and do different things, but we're sticking to the roots. Well, the other thing is, is that we, we're talking, you know, when we're talking about everything we've talked about in the last three videos, yeah. it's from our hearts. It's like it's, what we breathe and mm -hmm. live and every, do day, every day. Every day. So we're so not we love it. faking or no. pretending or trying to And you guys know that. You get to see everything we do. But yeah, are we sure. live on the Leah channel? We are. Hi, friends. <laughs> we've got <laughs> Wendy Hello, here everyone. saying hi. We've got Jeanette Smith. We've got Leslie, Portia, Kiko's here. They're all saying hi. Hi. And loving the set behind you. Oh, yes. Oh. Should we tell them what the set is? So we've moved yes. around to three different rooms. We're really in showing your space. new house <laughs> that I, we just moved into. And I have the photo and video studio here as well. So this is my, what I call my exotic tropical room. <laughs> <laughs> Painted these beautiful teal walls. Uh, redid the fireplace. This is a, a complete faux finish on the fireplace because I didn't like the tile and it's a rental, so I didn't want to mess it up. Yes. I, I just want to just take a moment, tell everyone when you moved in and so that they can ah. just look at how well everything is decorated. And for most people, in every room. Like, that's what I was about to say. Most people will be like, oh, it's just this one room. The entire house is so well decorated. Okay, we moved in June 22. June 22nd. It is now September 7th. Yeah. And it was done well. I mean, we I'm had the sure. to finish. Like this beautiful light just got put oh, up. Um, we it. wanted something a little more tropical. And we love this woven thing that's going on, but they're kind of expensive. And right. we found this at Ikea, you guys, and it looks beautiful. Yeah. We might do a little DIY on top of it at some point because <laughs> it was, we can. It wasn't of expensive. course. It's super so, inexpensive. Anyhow. But today, let's dive into what we're. What are we working on? We're working with iron on. We're we working are. with the easy press yes. and layering vinyl. Yes, and and cutting in large format. So super large. So we we were telling everyone yesterday, if you were here yesterday, that we feel like the best project to start with as a beginner with the Cricut is to do an iron on. And we love iron on. Like we do. We always go back to it. We There's do. so many different things you can do with it. And in Leah's house, she's used it so well. <laughs> In so many projects, a lot. <laughs> a lot. So it's yeah. really inspiring. And some of these projects, you, you want to show them. Let me show a few. So, yeah. so this, Here, this is one. actually in. This is actually part of the decor in this room. Yeah, it really is. Which guys. is okay. It and this, is, part this, of the this book. is foil iron on. Yes. So if you have ever thought about dabbling in foil iron on, you know you can take a, a pillow like this mm -hmm. and really create something unique, which we love. This was in our book, our SVG cut file book, and as was this, but. Um, we have very creative makers here, and one of our makers wanted to see what would happen if you layer foil, if you layer vinyl and do two layers. So there's actually a blue underneath the I gold. I don't know if you can see that. Do you want to can you see that? Yeah, twist, twist it. So it's very subtle, but it's there. There you can it see it. Definitely is. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And it adds just that fun texture. So you know we've been experimenting a lot, and then just this last week. Um, and this is the other room we're going to reveal because Tanner and I have been working on this mm -hmm. room over here that we're going to show you guys. So this was a project I wanted to try kind of a more large format mm -hmm. iron on and using multiple colors. And, you know, I, I cut them out and then I actually hand placed them. Yeah, do you want to talk about, about that? Because for me, I always second guess myself when it's coming to placing patterns and doing something like geometric and yeah. modern. You know, if someone at home is wanting to take something like this uh -huh. and create pillows, because I love how you've had multiple pillows as we're gonna show in the reveal. Mm -hmm. What do you do in placing them? Do you overthink it? Do no. you really? You don't. Okay, this is, this is. <laughs> this Give me is the tips, how, I wanna is, know. This is my creative tip of the day. When you're creating, turn off your brain, which is, can I say this on live? 
Why not? It's I, our show. I jokingly call it my smart ass. <laughs> <laughs> Turn off my brain and go to my heart and my intuition and just feel it. And just go with it. Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, so sometimes your brain gets in the way. Right. You know, and when you're creative, you just you have to stay yeah. down here in your intuition and just feel it. Mm-hmm. So that's what I would say. Well, this is a perfect tip to give <laughs> on a Friday because everybody hopefully is going to have some time this weekend. If you I'll are you going to have time this weekend to Fantastic. craft, let us know in the comments what you're working on. But I love this. These are, it's a, what we, is it a heart? Is it a heart? Or is it a leaf? Really? Or is it a heart? <laughs> or is it a leaf? <laughs> anyway, oh, and these pillows, these pillow forms and pillowcases, we got them at Ikea. So last Where's night... Where's that sponsorship? I know, right? <laughs> last night we... Um, we wanted to show you guys a new a new one that you guys could make too, and we ran over to IKEA and mm-hmm. got all the things. And so. Yeah, we and we found the pillows great, but it took mm-hmm. us a while to find our chocolate. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> it did take us a while. Yeah. Yes, uh, so Priscilla would like to know if you ironed that on with the inner inside the cushion or before you put the inner inside. Before the cushion, yes. and we're gonna do it right here. Yeah, we're gonna so do I'm, it. I, we're gonna do a different design. So here's our design today. This is actually something that. Uh, one of our makers and designers, Krista, so designed talented. quite a few years ago. We This is probably three years old, mm-hmm. and I love this design so much, but I wanted to replicate it partially because we can make it really big mm-hmm. and show you how to do big vinyl, mm-hmm. but also we're doing three colors. Three layers. And I'm going to show you how to do it. But if it's your first project, start with one color. Yeah, start with one yeah. one color. You know, find something that you love. But this is gonna be a great one because if you're ready to take that next step mm-hmm. and you want to layer it, we're gonna give you all the tips, all the tricks that you need. Should we start doing that? Yeah. So let's okay. start. So I'm gonna start with weeding. You know, we're using yes. iron on, and when you're cutting iron on, you want to make sure that you mirror your image because in this comes... case it doesn't matter because it's a it's a. This, oh, but if you're doing text, you might want to mirror yeah, your image. Yeah, if you're using text, and in general, no matter what, I just try to train my brain always turn on mirror. But mm-hmm. good tip. Oh, I've, I've I have made no that idea. So many times. I love that. Let's talk about the big mat really quick yeah. while you're weeding. Go okay, ahead and start we're going to start weeding. So the top. Th- this mat's probably not as sticky as it should be at this point. It's one of our <laughs> older ones. But um, one of the things when I was working on the bigger pillows, some of those designs needed to be a longer. Um, pattern so uh-huh. using the larger mat really works and then when I was working on some of the bigger pillows I had to cut apart my bits and pieces and then place them because I couldn't cut it that large so you do right. have to you could even draw yourself a graph if you wanted mm-hmm. to to kind of or, or, or even measure I and mean, there's no rush that's what's so wonderful about this material it's, it's sticky and show and you, you that it, place it. it has built-in transfer paper because I think for yeah. a beginner it's kind of confusing to realize yeah. that it has the transfer paper built in okay so you're not having to you know purchase anything else so this is face down so it's, mm-hmm. a, it's a gray color and it's face down on the mat and it has this plastic and then this is the actual iron-on vinyl right there um, so when you peel it off like Tanner's doing here, this is actually kind of sticky. And this is what we used as transfer tape when we put it down onto the actual item that we're going to iron on. Right. So you don't need transfer tape, you don't need anything. Um, someone asked yesterday, which I thought was a really great question, uh-huh. can you use any type of vinyl as an iron-on? The answer is no. no. So tell them what is yeah. your favorite type of iron-on, where do you get yours, you know, give us all, the, yeah. give us those details. <laughs> you, you too. So <laughs> we found in our studio, because we do a lot of iron-on, that we prefer the Cricut mm-hmm. brand because we honestly we found that it works best like it yeah. cuts best it feels it's reliable best. yeah and, and it lasts like you can wash it and yes, wash it and yes. it stays and also we found you know we, we wanted some other colors so we would purchase like maybe a rose gold or something now Cricut has rose gold Yay. and we would put it on and it was just so hard to peel the back paper off or mm-hmm. it wouldn't stick on the pillow right um, but we've never, ever, ever had that problem with Cricut Iron On. It's and, so reliable. I mean, that, I'm just talking from truth of what we've experienced. Yeah. That's all it is. Um, so that's what we usually use. And look mm-hmm. at how fast it is for me to weed this, like very yeah. effortlessly um, for such a large project. Mm-hmm. It's so easy with the weeding tools. So we love it. Yep. I'm just going yeah. through, looking at the design. So while you're doing that, Tana, do we have a giveaway that we need to oh. make sure? We do! <laughs> yes, so let's talk about that. So for uh-huh. each of us watching, um, if you are on Leah's channel, make sure you're subscribed to Leah's channel. If you're on my channel, subscribe to Leah. If you're on her channel, subscribe, subscribe to, to me. <laughs> subscribe to both of us. Both of us. And the links for both of our channels are down mm-hmm. below. And you'll be entered to win. We're picking three different winners. Okay. We're giving a year membership to Makers Gonna Learn from mm-hmm. me. And what are you from Leah Griffith? 
We're giving a, an annual membership to leahgriffith.com yes. and somebody will win um, the SVG cut file book. book. So do you want to grab the book? So you can share it. have to run to the other room. Okay, <laughs> grab the book. While he's waiting. While we're waiting, I'll give some weeding tips. Okay. So as you yeah, see here, guys, with iron on, it's one of the easiest things to weed. Like, this is super easy. Um, if you've watched one of my videos I have on tips for weeding, it has a ton of tips. And it actually talks about having a weeding box so you can put your little pieces in there, like reuse a tissue box or something, so it's not on your craft surface. Today, you know, we're crafting from this beautiful room. We didn't think about that. Um, but we're just grabbing and going, and it's super easy um, and relaxing. It is. Cherry yeah. says that she has subscribed to both of your membership oh, um, yeah. plans, so uh, I guess she's hoping to win the win book. The book. <laughs> yes. So the book is um, Cricut, uh, Cutting Machine Crafts, which you can use on your Cricut Sizzix or Silhouette, and it's 60 plus designs. But we go through, we, we don't really talk so much about how to use the machines, but what we do is teach you how to use these designs in different ways. So for instance, let me show you. Oh yeah, here's here's the pillow. So we use the same design to make the tote bag, the pillow, and also these paper greens. And then we have all the cut files to go with it. Um, this book is really about paper, vinyl, and iron-on. So that's all of our projects. Um, we have home decor is the first section. And it's, it's kind of the style that, you know, we do here at Leah Griffith. And then we have uh, kids crafts that are really cute. I mean, even though that's a kid's craft, I would probably use it because <laughs> I'm Aww. a kid at heart or something. I don't oh, know. yes. And then we have, um, you know, projects for kids. And then we have celebration, which would include, you know, different holidays or the having party. little parties. Yeah, there's a, a really fun Easter one that we've done. And all of the cut files come with the book. It's all downloadable. And where is this available so, it, for those who don't want to wait yeah, for the giveaway? <laughs> it's on Amazon.com and if you're a Prime member it's free shipping and I think yesterday there was actually a sale on the book. I think it was like around $14 mm -hmm. and that's 60 files. I mean do the math. That is do the incredible. Math. It's yeah. an amazing deal. Yeah. Thank so we had goodness. so much fun writing this book. And right? Yeah. Laurie Gibson yeah. says that she has her fingers and her toes crossed for this <laughs> giveaway. Yeah so be sure yeah. to subscribe again if you're just tuning in. We're doing a giveaway. Just be sure to subscribe to my channel as well as Leah's mm -hmm. link in the description and you'll be able to enter to win one of the three amazing prizes. So here we are. Finishing. I'm going to show them what else we weeded. Yes, one of the last pieces. Here I am going. I think there's one more piece that might be over on your side. Um, I think I put it over oh, on it yours. Fell down here. Okay. Oh, it? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, Hello, everyone. You can see my my belly button now. <laughs> so we have all these different pieces, and I'm look gonna, at yeah, this. I'm going to show you how to assemble. Oh my goodness. So when you're working with iron on, you really want to start with your largest piece first. Yep. So why would that be, Leah? Um, well, because you wouldn't really know where to put the ear pieces with exactly. that, you know, so it's the biggest template. And we're going to want to make sure the largest piece is put down first because we're going to actually teach you all why and how you reuse this piece of plastic. Yes. To protect exactly, your project. To protect it. All right, so I, my zipper's down at the bottom, mm -hmm. so I'm actually going to place it right at the edge, which I also did on these other pillows. Okay. I placed everything on the edge. Now, the one thing that I absolutely adore about this, the Easy Press, mm -hmm. which it looks like it went down in temperature, I'm going to move uh -oh. it back up again, because I, I like to do it uh, at at 360. What do you usually run it at? Ooh, I usually run it at 305. Really? Yeah. Oh, okay, I don't know what's right I don't know what's right either. <laughs> <laughs> All right, well, okay, I'm going to do 360 because that's what I've been doing. So it's going up right now. But the reason why I love this so much is that it, the, the temperature is even. Such evenly yes. distributed heat. I love the comparison. And it's that bigger. Cricket. It's bigger than an iron. So, so much easy. larger than and an iron. And it actually, I think in the mail, we'll probably get it right after we finish this. <laughs> we actually ordered a large yes, one. Yes, the 9 by 12. Which It'll be here after we finish. Of course, no big deal. <laughs> so but the, there's three different sizes. Yes, yeah. and I love my my new Easy Press too. It comes mm -hmm. in red. There's three sizes. I think it's a six by seven, a nine by nine, and a little one. Well, yeah. it's six by seven, six by nine by nine, nine, and then the nine by twelve, mm -hmm. I believe. I'm sure yeah. someone else out there could correct us. Um, right. But the three sizes, and there's a few it's different a shifts. Yeah. Um, but I also but we like love it. This one. Yeah, I like it because you don't have to put any cloth over this. Mm -hmm. You go straight down on the plastic. Yep. All right, it's at 3.15, so we're going to go because that, yeah. that was working. We so since it's not going to cover the whole thing, I'll just start at the top 
and I will push my button. Well, I can't yet because it's, right. the temperature is still coming. Mama Disney Actually, is asking, sorry, Leah, yes. Mama Disney is asking if there's anything else that they have to do to enter this fab giveaway other than subscribing to you, both your yes. channels. <laughs> Send us cookies. Yeah, no, send I'm us cookies. <laughs> <laughs> you can always share our video. Yeah. You can do whatever you want for extra entries. We will see it. Yeah, we'll um, see it. You can check us out on our Instagram. Yeah, you do a little extra. We'll throw a little <laughs> meme in, a, in the throw bucket. another one. <laughs> so it's actually going. So it, it went 30 seconds. Mm -hmm. Then I'm going to move it. And you can do it more than once mm -hmm. over the same mm -hmm. space. You really want to infuse this into your fabric right. anyway, so you really can't over iron it as mm -hmm. far as no. Now, do you give it even, do you apply yeah. pressure the uh -huh. entire time? I don't, but I should. <laughs> <laughs> but but I have something else that I do that I, it may not be something that Cricut says to do, but right. that's what I do. That's really fun. And that's when, I, after I pull it off and everything's done, I'll put a cloth over the top uh -huh. and do one more fuse. And what's good about this is that we're putting this down multiple times, so we don't want to overheat right. it too fast. So right. we're, you know, this is a three layer? We're doing three layers? Yes, So we there's are. three layers of iron on, so you do not want to over. You don't think so? Do what? Does it matter? I don't know. <laughs> well, let's find out. We'll find out. That's, I've never, it's I've never live. It. I mean, you can burn it if you don't have your plastic, but right. I've never seen it overheat. Well, it sometimes can start like shrinking up, I've found, if you're applying a huge pressure oh, to okay. it for three or four layers, but I think this is going to be perfect. I think it is. Okay, so... Esmeralda would like to know um, when the Easy Press 2 is available. It's available now? Ooh, well, it's not available for sale. Oh, okay. Um, it'll be a launching this fall. When is it available this fall? They they don't, they, have, they don't have a date. Oh we, goodness! Cricket, if you See, were watching, he's more we are than I am. <laughs> we are ready for the date. Everybody is <laughs> looking very forward to being Matthew's able to, shaking his head to purchase. <laughs> <laughs> we're like Laurel and Hardy here. <laughs> we should do this every day. <laughs> we can make a craft every day for you guys. Should we do a reality TV show? Just I'm imagine kidding. us I'm testing kidding. our craft projects <laughs> every day. But then we'll have to have mistakes and we'll have to be like, oh no, that's going to cost that'd us $3,000 more dollars. Oh yeah, that would be easy. That'd be easy. <laughs> your plumbing's really bad in your basement. <laughs> oh my goodness. I yes. love it. Okay, so one more. So I've, I've got uh -huh. six times. And, and what, if we had the larger one, it would have been like two hits. I know. Just I know. two. So imagine. It's in the mail. <laughs> yes, it's in the mail. UPS, come on. <laughs> Okay. So what are you one. making here? Do you want to remind us what it is you're yes. making? Yes. <clears throat> so if you are just tuning in, we are making some amazing DIY fall decor. We're making some pillows and we're giving a large reveal of Leah's brand new entryway. Which you helped me decorate. Yes. <laughs> We've had so much fun pulling new colors for this fall look. We are yes. using the wreath that we created on Wednesday. Uh -huh. And then we created a little uh, project yesterday that we showed online. And then today we're making another pillow. So you can see it's peeling up just a little. That's okay as long as it doesn't crumple or right. wrinkle because, because you're going to hit it again. it again. Yeah. So let's look how pretty that. I mean, that's uh, gorgeous, just like that. You know, right? sometimes I never would have thought about doing kind of like a gray on gray, but this right here looks <laughs> amazing. Yeah, we like gray on gray. Okay, here you can help me do all okay. these little bits and pieces. Yeah, so we're just going to piece it out. So I'm going to just you know overlay it mm -hmm. and place it on. Um, one of the things that I would say is super duper important Perfect. is once this. once you once you pull so you can put your iron straight onto the plastic, but never put your iron straight onto mm -hmm. this because mm -hmm. it will melt. I do know that. <laughs> so I pulled apart my little ears. Evelyn wants to know what the difference between the two easy presses are, the original one that you're using today and the new one that's going to be released. Yes, so there are a few differences. They redesigned the cradle, so the new cradle um, is a little bit slimmer and sleeker. Uh, they that's have it here. with um, USB now, so you're able to plug it in um, to do any firmware updates for settings and different things. Um, you know, they're just constantly improving it, and obviously the new three sizes is probably my favorite part. Okay, so since we have, we do not want to touch this with our iron. Correct. We're going to take reuse this. Reuse it, yes. And reuse it over the top. So, so never throw that away when you're doing multi-layers. Yep. And that way, we'll start with this one. Mm -hmm. Press the button, 30 seconds. It's going to be good to go. Now, yeah. do you like to hit the back of your project sometimes? Is there an instance that you want to make sure you hit the back I, yeah. of a project? Yeah, I think it's always important that 
the way I see it is it needs to be infused mm -hmm. into the fabric. It's just like heat possible. and bond, mm -hmm. which I yeah. love using. Speaking of heat and bond, With the this, easy press, in, heat and yes. bond game changer uh -huh. for any, I love doing like using felt on pillows mm -hmm. and I heat and bond it mm -hmm. to fuse them together. You know what I use heat and bond for? Tell me. Great paper. Really? Yes. What type of projects would we, that happen? We would make, that? see I have to hit it twice here mm -hmm. because it's too wide. We have that larger one. I know. <laughs> <laughs> um, heat and bond, we use it to, to infuse two pieces of extra fine crepe paper together to make the double sided. So if we want a special color that we don't mm -hmm. have, mm -hmm. we just do that. It's so easy and it's it, it's beautiful. I love it. And this and this is what works. Yes. It, Better than an iron. Amazing. Because it has to be melted or else it, it cracks apart. Right. Mm -hmm. oh. So Dina's just joined us. She's new to Hello. both your channels. Oh my gosh. Well, I'm so happy you found <laughs> yes. us. Yes, welcome, welcome. And a couple of people asking where to find both your YouTube channels. So, so whichever, if you're watching on Leah's, if you're watching on mine, you're gonna find links to both of our channels in the description of mm -hmm. the videos. So go ahead, click the button, subscribe to both of our channels so that you're gonna be able to see all of the new videos coming out for the holiday season mm -hmm. on both of our channels. And it's gonna be fun. It is. Do you have any fun projects you wanna kind of give us a little sneak peek? <laughs> yeah, anything you can share um, telling well, <laughs> them what's coming up on your channel? Well, there, there's a lot. We are doing some really fun Halloween projects, Ooh. and we've decided this year we were trying to mix it up a little bit different. Okay, so this one's not quite well. This, of course, oh. yeah, it's not quite coming off. Mm -hmm. So I'm you gonna let it, it cool. Again? Okay. Yeah, I'm gonna like let it cool a little bit more. Sometimes the foil is a the little trickier. The foil is trickier. a little trickier. I definitely think, you know, once you've used iron on and got comfortable with it mm -hmm. is when you can kind of like advance yep. up to foil. Mm -hmm. But once you do, you're going to love it. Like yeah. working with foil is going to give you like those amazing projects. It's a little harder to peel the back off. Right. Oh, here's mm -hmm. what I'm going to If you're just tuning in with us, we've been sharing all kinds of ways mm -hmm. to use iron on and your easy press. Yeah, I'm going to let it cool before I yeah, peel. Yeah, let it cool. Mm -hmm. Um, but you know, we were sharing all kinds of things. So at the end of today's video, we are going to share Leah's new entryway for fall. With all the pillows. With all the I pillows. Did, yeah. Yes. It's going to be a lot of fun. Okay. Cool, cool, cool. Letting it cool. Should we tell them about the, you know, about the prize that we're giving away today? Right. So we're giving away th three lucky winners. We'll either, we're giving away one year membership to leahgriffith.com one um, year membership to Makers to Learn, which is our die cutting membership. And then we're also giving away one of our, one of Leah's, I say ours now. Oh, you can say ours, okay. <laughs> One of Leah's, a copy of Cutting Machine Crafts by Leah for your die cutting machine. And this comes with 60 SVG files. How amazing is that? Mm -hmm. Let's flip through this book because it's just beautiful. Look, look, look at this, people. Okay, I'm gonna look start up here. This. Here's the, oh my, look at this, we got this. Here, yeah. Does this look familiar? <laughs> anyway, <laughs> we love it. So yeah, I love this book. It's so much inspiration to help you guys stay creative, which we love. There's a lot of love here. There is a lot of love here. We, we just have fun <laughs> we love all everything. day. You know, it has been such a fun week here. I'm actually sad to have to leave tomorrow. <laughs> I know. All right, now I'm doing foil. I have a trick to foil, <gasps> and you tell me what you usually do. Okay. So because it, it is a little more tricky, Mm -hmm. I always roll it at a sharp angle. That is a great tip for vinyl in general, like yeah. whether it's iron on, whether it's, you know. And see how I'm hitting the side. Mm -hmm. I don't want to do it at that angle. So Correct. I'm going to move it Look around. That. Effortless. It's a little warm still, but yes. since we're on video and we want to oh, oh. get this done. Right. See, now if it starts to peel up, you can probably get it off. And since I'm going to do one more hit, mm -hmm. uh, no, it's not going to come off. I'll try it this way. Okay. Since it's, I'm, I'm going to do one more hit mm -hmm. of iron, it's okay. Right. We love that. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so sometimes if it doesn't come off one direction, mm -hmm. I'll go another direction. Mm -hmm. As long as everything is in place, no problem. Right. Because you can see it came up there, but that's all right. So we're going to hit it again. We're going to hit it again. Oh, and look at that one. It mm -hmm. came perfect. Awesome, awesome. So do we have any questions? Is Are there anything that... Um, at the minute, wondering. just so much love for what you're doing. <laughs> hey, <laughs> that's okay. great. Yeah, so you can see, it. we'll just kind of pat that down. Now, Beautiful. before I put the next one on, because that wasn't quite oh, used, right on then. Um, the next thing that I do, I keep these little ironing cloths in my mm -hmm. sewing room anyway for all kinds of projects. Yes. And it's just like a cotton sheet, like 100% cotton. Mm -hmm. And that's what I'll do my final hit with, which we're not final yet, but because right. that was still peeling up, I mm -hmm. wanted to make sure it we're just wanting to make sure it's bonded. So yeah, this is perfect. 
And now here's our final layer. Mm -hmm. And look at this pink. What, what color pink would you consider this? I love I this color. Like blush. I think that yeah. is their new blush color. I think it is. And yeah. it's, it works Which so I love, well. Love, love, love. Like, look at this with this gray. It's mm -hmm. going to be such a fun one. We, yeah, I, I have fallen in love with pink this year, and yeah. it's all over my house. <laughs> well, you're going to see it. The inside of some of my bookcases in the family room. Mm -hmm. Okay. And I love that. You got Maybe a little, it's a little, little crazy. Accent. No. no. Look, no, no. you could iron your sheets. <laughs> <laughs> I was telling Leah with the new Easy Press, Rachel, uh, my assistant, she just got um, no. had our wedding shower and we did 10 oh, tables. Oh, yes. Yeah, I want to hear what you're saying. You oh, so we um, did 10 tablecloths with the new Easy Press too. Just ironed them. Yeah, we just ironed them because they were so wrinkly and, you know, on a short amount of time, we need the largest iron available. Okay, I want to show everybody. It looks Look beautiful it. just like yeah, this. Yeah, we can leave it just like this. Like you can uh, be done, although there's pink in the ears, but that's okay. <laughs> And then look at this. We're just going to be able to add this last layer mm -hmm. and right like so. Oh, and then look at the little nose. So what is it you're using underneath the cushion? There? Yeah, I'll tell you. <clears throat> um, so yes. I had an expert sewist on my team at one point. <laughs> we miss her dearly. And she created this for us. It's actually just a piece of board, like a, a small, I'll, I'll turn it over as soon as. Oh, one second. There yeah. it is. It's just a piece of board. And yeah. then, and then she put quilt padding, like layers of quilt padding on mm -hmm. a cotton quilt padding, and then a cotton, like um, a thick canvasy Very. type cotton on, on the top, and actually just velcroed it. it. Velcroed it. Yeah, so Smart. that we can take it off and wash it. And I it just—it's a really great tabletop DIY tabletop ironing board. Perfect for if you're using a yes. surface like this. Uh -huh. You want to make sure. Oh, I think it might have shifted. I think it looks pretty good. Perfect. Two quick questions. Um, a couple of people asking where the book is available, and Betsy would like to know if you've done all that the iron on there in one layer. Yes. So the book is, is available on Amazon. Where else do you like to pick up the book? Um, we have it on our site, LeahGriffith.com. Yes, LeahGriffith.com. Target.com. Walmart.com. Walmart.com. Love that. And then this is actually a multi-layer iron-on project. So, so we did we, not do it all at once. So was it Betsy? Yes, Betsy, Betsy if you're just tuning in, okay. be sure to watch the recorded part where we've been layering, sharing our tips for working mm -hmm. with foil, multi-colors, everything like that. Um, you can, can check that way. out. So actually, I don't need this here, but what I'm going to do is just cover this so mm -hmm. I don't hit it. Just for safety? Just for safety, and I have to make sure, so I don't want to do that. Where's my big piece oh, of plastic? Oh, our big piece of plastic, do I put it over here? No, I probably <laughs> There it is. Okay. <laughs> it's Friday. It's Friday. Guys, um, as we are finishing up this layer, leave a comment and let us know what you're working on this weekend. Do you have any projects that you're working on? Um, I'm making a lot of noise. <laughs> <laughs> to enter the giveaway, we're giving away um, a year membership to Makers Gonna Learn, a year membership to Leah Griffith, and a copy of Cutting Machine Crafts that we're going to announce the winner Monday. Mm -hmm. So be sure to, if you're watching the recorded over the weekend, still leave your comments and be sure to subscribe to both of our channels, linked below, um, for more fun. And you'll be entered to win one of our three lucky prizes. Mm -hmm. And maybe be a contestant on the Tanner and Leah show someday. <laughs> yes. <laughs> yes. I'm kidding. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. You gotta have fun with it, right? Definitely. And what is it we're revealing at the end? At the end, we're going to reveal kind of like what we've been working on all week together. Mm -hmm. And it's Leah's entryway for fall. With some the fall decor. It's mm -hmm. fall decor. It's unique projects. We have used our paper flowers Leah taught me how to make. We've used... And the wreath we made together. The, wreath, the first yes, paper wreath Tanner's ever the made. The first one. And hopefully not the last. Because we're going to work so. together more. Mm -hmm. And you've inspired me to really take it back home and teach Courtney and Rachel mm -hmm. yeah. how to make paper flowers as well. Mm -hmm. And Emily hooked me up with some crepe paper, so I'm very excited. <laughs> oh, and I don't know, I, I think we could probably, you know, this is a very private, close group of people watching us here. Of course, our group. Um, there will be an event. Can you share that? Yeah, I think we can. Oh. Okay. We haven't announced the date yet. Yes, no? Oh, you can definitely <laughs> okay. announce it. Yes, go. We are, there's, going to, there's going to be an event in Portland mm -hmm. in Early November. Early November. And it is going to be a cricket event. Mm -hmm. We'll be making paper flowers. And Tanner will be here. We're making it happen. <laughs> yes. Um, and it's, it's going to be an absolutely amazing event. Yes. Because everything Leah does is amazing. Yeah. So <laughs> thank you. Yeah. So watch for details because we're yeah. going to be announcing it probably by the end of next week. How exciting. Uh -huh. And this is, I'm sure the seats are going to fill up fast. So be yes. sure to follow along. There's only 100 along. seats. A hundred. This is going to be well, an exclusive. Well, ninety-nine because you're going to be yeah. actually you're going to be helping. So. <laughs>
Slave labor, y'all. We'll, we'll give your seat to someone else. I love it. So, Emily, what is everyone talking about? So, comedy comments of the day goes to Esmeralda, who has noticed that neither of you have shoes on. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> All right, who's looking at our shoes? Who's looking at our shoes, and how can they tell that? Well, that's because um. this beautiful new house is a no-shoe zone. No-shoe zone. <laughs> we, we're, we're trying to keep it clean and not have to have, oops, house cleaners too often. <laughs> <laughs> is Marilda put it down to the fact that Tanner is just so comfortable here? Well, that's oh, true. Yeah, I mean, that okay, is honestly is very true. Here. If I take this one off Yes, first. it sure will. Okay, see, you can kind of be with us in our own comedy here. We're just cracking it we're up We're very today. human. <laughs> And that's the best part of love is because everyone at home has had one of these instances. So I really like to embrace when stuff like this takes a little bit longer than expected so we can work through it together, you know? We've had quite a few comments and questions about using the foil. Do you have any more tips yeah. that you can run um, through? Well, first of all, foil is super easy to weed. So that's one of the things I love about foil. Mm -hmm. And actually, we got one of the projects that we're using. Um, this is my favorite. Actually, I'm not. We'll just pull this one up because it's already put back <laughs> and I don't want to have to put it back. Matthew worked hard. So with foil, it gives such a finished look. Um, it's super easy to weed and you just want to be a little careful with it and be sure to look at the packaging because for every different type of iron on, mm -hmm. Cricut recommends a different setting. Yes. Um, so be sure to So when you mix reference. it like this, it becomes a big <laughs> pot of stew. Be sure to <laughs> reference your package settings. Um, so that it tells you exactly what temperature, how long you need to leave it on for. Is it 30 seconds? Is it 45? The instructions tell <laughs> you. Or when you mix you. it up like this. <laughs> <laughs> when we're using multiple different packs and different things, you kind of have to wing it. But yeah, definitely just read that. And I actually love foil because look at what a, what a finished look this is, right? We love it. Okay. I finally have that off. Uh, look at this. Oh yes. my gosh. Oh, I think our um, our big iron just showed up. <laughs> oh, the mailman has arrived. <laughs> All right, so we're gonna do one more pass with the cloth over the top. Okay. Just to, there was a few pieces that weren't quite sealed. Mm -hmm. and it's really important. So, 360, 30 seconds. Love we're gonna it. go for it. Yes. And push it down. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, give it evenly distributed pressure. Yep. So actually, our big surprise today was giving the giveaway. Right. But then, but then, reveal but then the reveal. reveal. We've got the giveaway, the reveal. Leah just announced um, a crepe paper class here. <laughs> a Cricut, in, a Cricut crepe mm -hmm. paper flower event coming up in early November. How get exciting ready for the is that? Yes. yes, get ready for the holidays. Yeah. Isn't that right? Yep. It's coming up super soon. It's going to be Halloween before you know it. Thanksgiving's going to fly by and Christmas. Whew, everybody. And then it's Valentine's Day. <laughs> <laughs> Isn't that true? Oh yeah. I love it. It never stops, and then it comes around a year again. Yep. The next year. There it is. All right, so. we're almost done, you guys. Is there a pillow fill somewhere? Is there a pillow fill? You know what? Just on the table, Tana. Okay. Okay. On the table. Is it? Oh, here it is. It was hiding you in the light. All right, four, three, so, two, multi purpose. One. You can use this as a little poke tool. Yeah, you guys can see this is how you buy your pillows. This is my go-to. And how much is this one? It was such an affordable price. I think it was under ten dollars. I, I know it's six. And it, is it six? At that I think it's six. I think you're right. And it's um, it's it's feather, which I prefer. I know I some people are sleeping allergic. on a feather yeah, pillow. Yeah, I do too. But I always pull these off. Done. Because they're in Bye. The and then fluff it up a fluff bit. Fluff it up. Fluff it okay. up. And here is our finished. Look at this, guys. We just used three. Three, colors, three different colors, including a foil. Including foil on this amazing project. And this is going into my family room. Ooh. So you'll all have to stay tuned for when we reveal the family room. Right. Patricia is asking how you store your vinyl. Ooh, mm -hmm. I love how you all <laughs> store your vinyl. Well, you tell me how you store yours, and I'll share okay, how okay. I store mine. Well, for a long time, we just had um, some cube shelving mm -hmm. that I think we got at Michael's, and we just stacked them, you know, mm -hmm. in a big pile. And we would mark it so it'd be, you know, vinyl, iron-on, glitter, you know, right. so we'd have, have them separately. But you'd have to pull it out. Yes, you'd have to pull and, and you have to anyway. Yeah, yeah. And then we would have, like, a white drawer that went in that had pieces and extra mm -hmm. things. So if we needed just a little scrap, we could find that. And now, if you go look at our, we have a post of our craft room, and we actually had a custom-made um, cabinet that, puts them in stacks like this mm -hmm. so that you don't have, they don't get all 
mumble jumble. Right. I love <laughs> and it. And we marked it, you know, so you can find yeah. it. Yeah. Really so easy. for us, what we've done is we found yeah. it's very hard to tell vinyl and iron on a part uh -huh. when you're looking at it mm -hmm. from afar. So we have these mm -hmm. two blue tubs sitting on a shelf together. And for our rolls of it, we divide it between vinyl and <gasps> iron on. I, I can wear this. <laughs> Wait, this is my new skirt. <laughs> I love it. Does How it make fun. Look bad? <laughs> <No>. <laughs> um, so we just store it in tubs, but what we do, you know, if we have a little small piece, we again have two smaller clear uh -huh. totes. Yep. They're about one yay says vinyl, big. one says iron. Exactly. Yep. So we can go through that and use it first before opening a new roll yes, or yes. anything like that. Mm -hmm. I've been trying to for the month of September use scraps because mm -hmm. we have so many. I actually love doing that. That's one of our favorite things is to make projects with what we have in our craft room. Oh, isn't and not it? Mm -hmm. things. Mm -hmm. I think we all have a thing to order, but yeah. when you just use, it's kind of like a creative challenge. Use what you got. Yes, I see love how that. long you can go. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Anything we need to wrap up? Oh, we're going to quick question awesome. before so we do the yes. reveal. Can you remind us where the insert and the cover are mm -hmm. from? Please? Yes, IKEA. So this is a. I think it's a natural fiber. It's not linen, yeah. but it looks like linen. It's right with so, all the others. Yeah, it's a natural fiber, and I believe it was under $10. Mm -hmm. And then the filler, I believe, was 6 and it's feather. So yeah. IKEA is our go-to for these things. Yeah. And the room I'm going to reveal, I'm just laughing because I seriously could just be wearing this. <laughs> I mean, it matches your, well, you've got your pink, you've got your purpose. Purpose. No, you did Actually, I had no idea what, because I had Krista cut this, so I didn't uh -huh. even know what color she was going to use. <laughs> Um, I love it. Yeah, so this is my go-to, and the pillows we're going to show you guys in a minute over here were also from Ikea because they yes. have all kinds of great colors. Should we do Should we, a little Are we ready over? to reveal? Do we want to share one more something. time about yes, the, giveaway? the giveaway? Before we get all into the entryway, guys, we are having a giveaway. We're giving away a year of LeahGriffith.com, a year of Makers Gonna Learn, and one of a copy of Cutting Machine Crafts. We've made it really easy for you guys to opt in for this. All you need to do is subscribe to both of our channels mm -hmm. to be entered to win. So and if you want an extra little drop in the bucket, share the video. Share the video on your favorite social <laughs> yeah. platform. So Matthew, are you ready to move? All right. Mm -hmm. okay. Matthew has a, a big camera here, <laughs> so you'll have to give him a little peek. On so Canada's. here we are. Yeah, let them see Matthew. They, they can see Matthew again. Ooh, Should look at this. Let's sit down. Let's sit down. Right. Oh, oh, now they can see I'm our holding this mic because this is my favorite pillow. I'm the holding heartbeat, this. The heartbeat. <laughs> well, turn it as a heart. Heart. Yes. Because we love you guys. Yes, it is. We do. We do. So in this one. These are my sunsets. In this one set, how many projects do we have? We have one, mm -hmm. two, three, four, five, six. <laughs> We have so many the basket. projects. Oh yeah, the, oh, ba yes. the basket is a project that was done a while ago. Actually, our sewist did this when she was here. It's made out of um, a clothing line, and really? so yeah, you know, not this, the oh, basket. Yes. Wait, she? What do you? She made the basket. Yes. You're lying. No, no. I'm is, not lying. is it on the blog? Yes, it is. <laughs> I love that. Yeah. But this, this is the piece that resists all this, right? <laughs> we this love right this. This right here is Tanner's flower. And then there's a few more in here, but I know yeah. that one because it's very special. <laughs> I love it, guys. This was so much fun. So if you are, are, this is the first video you see with me and Leah. We actually have two other videos mm -hmm. that we've made this week. One teaching you three perfect beginner paper flowers. Yes. Mm -hmm. And then yesterday we answered 10 of our most asked Cricut questions. Mm -hmm. And those videos are on both of our channels. So after this, check it out so you can see these projects really come to life. Mm -hmm. um, and we love it. And Think this entryway do you want to talk about kind of like what we decided for fall in these colors yeah. so we knew i mean fall is such a big season everyone's done the summer people are going back to school and i we see a lot of people wanting to decorate their i think homes they want to get fall. ready for it because they're right. they, they've been so busy in the summer at mm -hmm. least for me Make when a little falls change. here they need the shift in their mm -hmm. decor so mm -hmm. they feel it even before maybe the weather Bring gets a little there. Joy. Yes. Yeah. So I wanted to do something different with my fall decor this year and not do the traditional colors, which is very common for me to not do traditional <laughs> colors. And so I, 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 I'm in love with pink, as you know, yeah. and for this, some reason. It just happened this year, I have no idea. Yellow? And then, so I've used pink a lot in the last year and then adding in this saffron color, which you're seeing it everywhere, everywhere. in fashion, and if you go to any retail store that has sort of a, more of a, you know, 
current vibe, mm -hmm. the saffron is such a, a huge color, and I love the flavor of fall that it brings. Right. So mm -hmm. I love this. So you could use the knife blade to make this fun project. We Which love. was supposed to be wood. It was wood. supposed to be wood or heavy duty chipboard. Um, I love how you were able to use foil and regular iron-on for the pillows. I very carefully picked those yes, colors. Yes, yeah. they're really <laughs> awesome colors. Yes. And then we were able to use, um, we actually- Three different papers. Three different papers for this project, and it turned out to be such a fun project. Mm -hmm. I love the pop of green from this, mm -hmm. and as soon as you walk in, it really is a wowing. A wow. Mm -hmm. It's a beautiful entryway. <laughs> yeah, Emily, what is, what awesome. is everyone saying? Do you know, they're all going wild <laughs> for this look. <laughs> Yeah. Like just the colour palettes and um, the pillows particularly oh, get a lot, lot of, <laughs> a lot of a lot of love. But that's uh, no questions. People oh, are I just <laughs> just Yay. loving what you guys have done. This that's week. great. So much love for it. And this was so much fun. Thank okay. you so much again for inviting me to <laughs> Portland. <laughs> I love it. But no, seriously, thank you for inviting me into your home and you know your offices to be able to come and hang out and. And we hopefully like inspire. Mm -hmm. That's you know why we're here. Yeah, I, exactly. That that was the whole point. Yeah, is to take the Tanner energy and the Leah energy and share it out. Definitely. And hopefully, leave us a comment and let us know. Are you go trying to make one of these projects this weekend? Mm -hmm. Definitely get creative. And if you make a comment, you're in the drawing. So when yes, <laughs> be sure to subscribe to both channels again to enter the giveaways mm -hmm. and. This weekend, like I've been saying, is going to be a perfect time for you to get ready for fall decor. Mm -hmm. So it's going to be a lot of fun. Do you have any other fun projects you're working on next week? I can't remember. <laughs> <laughs> I've been so focused on this week. I can't yeah, remember. I've got an event going on at the end of next week in Gatlinburg, Tennessee. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Okay. So I'm teaching a few cricket classes there. Um, but we have our virtual summit with you coming mm -hmm. up, which we are so excited because we were able to snag some crepe paper yeah. to actually send out in boxes. Yes. So thank you for coming to the summit. It'll be the end of October, October 20th and 21st. So that'll be another fun thing we're doing together. Yes. And you have your in-person Portland event coming up at the beginning of November. We might Portland. have to do another live or two. Um, that's yeah, that's yeah. already planned. Okay. Like, <laughs> so tell, tell us what you guys want us to talk yeah, about. Yeah, tell us for the next live stream. Let us know what we should tackle next. Mm -hmm. You know what you want us to see do, us do together. <laughs> and we're we're just gonna enjoy my last night in Portland. I know. <laughs> I'm gonna make dinner. We're not. What gonna are we having? having? I don't know. What do you want? <laughs> Crepes, we're making crepes. <gasps> I'm excited. <laughs> okay, Matthew, what is there anything you want to say? This has been like a three days. Uh, Matthew's yeah. been our sidekick yeah. the whole time. He's like walking around. I'm just this. anxious because my controls are over there. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I love it. Emily has been such a trooper to man my camera. So thank you, Emily. Yeah. If everyone loves her accent, like give her some love because I just could <laughs> listen to her talk all day. And your accent? <laughs> Do you know your viewers are all off to Ikea now? So. Oh, yeah. oh. No, seriously. I'm literally running out the door. I'm four hours away from Ikea, so I'm just honestly Ikea.com, you can order some of this stuff too. Yeah, that's so. true. And I stock up for like a good like mm -hmm. three or four months. And I have to say, when we went last night, we couldn't find this color. Mm -hmm. It was already sold out, which is gone. disappointing. But they, had, they still have this color. And that's the beauty about Iron On. You know, you can yeah. make it your own color. You can add, <laughs> yeah. you know, so. And you can always just dye it. Like that's a, true. Make it another step. Make Oops. it another project. Get a basic one from the craft store, a color mm -hmm. of dye, you know, red has so many awesome vibrant mm -hmm. colors. Um, you can go through and, and dye it and too. And that's another show. And that, come back. <laughs> we will teach you how to dye your own fabrics. <laughs> okay, guys. Awesome, guys. Bye to the Leah Griffith group. Yes. Bye to the Tanner group. Yes. We've had a great week with you guys. It has been so much fun. And again. I'm kind of sad. I know. How, how should we end it off? Be sure to subscribe to both of our channels. <laughs> For the giveaway. <laughs> Give us a little dance. A little dance. Do, 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 yeah, do a little dance in your Wellingtons do, while I go do, over do, and turn do, this do. off. Do, do, do. <laughs> oh. Bye guys. I didn't even have a lot all the way. <laughs>